Hi everybody, this is Josh. Um, I've shipped a lot of stuff over the past few years and I made this video just to show one way to ship small but heavy things in a fast but uh, also affordable and safe manner. So here we've got a couple batteries. Um, these weigh well over the uh, 13 ounce USPS first class limit and USPS first class mail is by far the cheapest way, cheapest and fastest way to ship small items that aren't that heavy but these are over the limit so in order to ship these via something like a parcel post it would cost me um, somewhere between uh, eight dollars all the way up to maybe ten dollars depending on distance um, using priority mail it's going to cost me five dollars and five cents if I print my postage online and uh, that's what I do so the way I do this is I will wrap these up inside some bubble wrap like this and I'll wrap it up quite a few times get it nice and snug in there and then when it's all wrapped up place these guys inside the box lengthwise like this and again they'd be all wrapped up but I can't show you that right now I don't have enough hands but they'd be wrapped up like this perhaps fill up this empty space with some material to keep them from jiggling around and then this box once closed serves as a great barrier um, and puncture uh, resistant material. Right, so I'll close it up and I'll either seal it or tape it. And then this thing is pretty indestructible. And then what you can do with this, this is my favorite part, is that you can take this box, open up this priority mail envelope, and you can slide this box in. So that's what I'm going to do now. And this box will fit in here really well. As you can see, it fits in and it takes a little bit of work to fold this flap up and get it get it sealed. I usually fold it up, seal it with the sticky stuff that's here, and then tape it. But it works really well. I just realized I did that all upside down. So again, get the box in here, seal it with the stickum, seal it with some more tape here and then place your label and for five dollars and five cents whatever you can fit in there goes <laughs> 